Photoshop CS6 contains a really great set of highly requested features and user-inspired improvements, specifically for designers. I'm really excited about this release because we made a concerted effort this time to focus on some of the top asks we've been getting for some time. For one, we're introducing real vector layers in Photoshop now, where you can quickly add and edit dashed and dotted lines. We also have Snap to Pixel for those perfectly rendered lines, and Layer Search, which will make it really easy to find that particular layer amongst hundreds of layers that you're working with. These are just some examples of the changes we have for designers. Let me actually show you some. Starting off with Layer Search, I can go ahead and turn on Layer Search and find my layers based on layer name. Or I can find my layer based on the type of layer. For instance, here I'm filtering out all my vector layers. I can also filter out all my text layers. Or I can do additive searches to look for all my text layers as well as my vector layers. I'm going to go ahead and target the particular layer that I want, zoom in a bit, and here we have this layer targeted. I can go ahead and change the options from the options bar. I can directly, using my vector tools, change the fill and the stroke properties, as well as adding a simple color or a gradient or a pattern to any of the fill or stroke properties. But the best thing of all is I can actually select that layer and change this to a dashed or dotted lines easily from the options bar. Improvements around these vector layers introduces a lot of time savers and benefits. But as I mentioned earlier, we have a whole slew of other JDI improvements. These are just do it features, features specifically for designers. They're user inspired small changes and improvements to the application that greatly improve productivity and save you time. For instance, back in Photoshop here, I can select multiple layers and hit Command J to duplicate them at the same time, or I can invoke this from the menu. I can also change the color label of multiple layers at a single time or lock them, or even change the blend mode. I can group these layers, select the group, and then apply a layer effect or style. So again, these are just some examples of the awesome changes and JDI features that we have for any designer working in Photoshop.